Coronavirus is a virus that causes respiratory illness. It was first identified in Wuhan, Hubei Province, China. There are thousands of confirmed cases in China, and cases outside Wuhan city. There is currently no vaccine to prevent 2019 NCOV infection, there are methods you can take to lower your chances of contracting the virus. The first is the most common advice when it comes to infectious disease prevention, washing your hands. Wash your hands often with soap and water for at least 20 seconds is very effective. Frequent hand washing is one of the best ways to avoid getting sick and spreading illness. As you touch people, surfaces, and objects throughout the day, you accumulate germs on your hands. It's almost impossible to keep your hands completely germ-free. Washing your hands frequently can help limit the transfer of bacteria, viruses and other microbes. If soap and water aren't available, use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer that contains at least 60% alcohol. Avoid touching your eyes, nose, and mouth with unwashed hands. Viruses can get into the body through the mouth, nose, breaks in the skin, and eyes. Once viruses are inside the body they can stop it from working properly. They may breed very quickly and in a very short time. Avoid close contact with people who are sick. I think this is pretty obvious advice, but it's still worth mentioning. Cleaning and disinfect frequently touched objects and surfaces is another great preventive method to reduce the chances of contractive disease-causing agents. If you have already contracted a virus, there are things you can do to avoid spreading it to others. The tips mentioned earlier in the video also work well when you don't want to spread the virus to others. Another tip is staying at home when you are sick. We all understand that time is money, but we should also consider how spreading illnesses can affect others. Cover your cough or sneeze with a tissue, then throw the tissue in the trash. Throwing the used tissue in the trash lowers the chances of someone else coming into contact with your mucus and becoming infected. If tissue isn't available, another option is sneezing into the crook of your elbow. But please do not sneeze into your hands. These tips aren't just for preventing the spread of the coronavirus. They are also habits that we can practice every day that can help prevent the spread of several viruses. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe.